At first glance, this looks like your average house on the hill, but it wouldn't be possible without the powerful rays of the sun. Oh, it's very doable. There's nothing new here. Uh, this, is, um, this is not new technology. It's quite proven. It's just a matter of, of learning about it. Some may think a completely solar-powered home is something from a sci-fi future. But Beverly and Will Ert have been completely dependent on solar panels for three years now. We built the house using solar panels. We run every piece of equipment you could imagine. And um, we intend to run a whole household and no sacrifices. I'm going to have an electric range. I'm going to have a dryer and a dishwasher, everything. Everything means they didn't skimp on luxuries. And this is the famous root cellar, which doesn't have shelves yet, but we used it all winter this winter and it was just fabulous. And the couple's dream home came down to location, location, location. So we looked all over the place. We went to Australia, we looked at the Yukon, which of course doesn't have enough sun at all. And uh, finally he said, hey, I like Manitoba. We go visit your family, it's great there. I, yes, we can go back to Manitoba. Manitoba is ideal because an array collects more power in colder temperatures. This solar array collects the sun's rays, which gets stored in a battery. So here are our batteries. They're the energy storage for our system. Uh, they hold about 42 kilowatt hours, which gives us five days supply of electricity at the rate that we use it at. Then it's run through an inverter to convert it to everyday energy. There we go, toaster's on. In the end, it will power their home and heat it. But getting this done is a massive undertaking for only two people. It's taken longer than, than we thought possible. I did run a construction company, so uh, in, you know, I optimistically thought, oh, we can do this in eight months, but I forgot about you know, the other 10 guys. <laughs> so, <laughs> so with just the two of us, we've been at this for two years. The initial cost of solar power is high, but the Earths say its benefits pay off in the long run. Even people at home can get involved in a small way by something called community solar gardens. That to me is the future of solar power in Manitoba, which is large arrays people buy a share in. They don't have to have it on their roof. They don't have to have it in their yard. Renters can do it. People in houses with bad siting, people in houses with shading can do it. Uh, they don't have to know anything about solar. They don't have to see it. They just buy it. And then Manitoba Hydro takes the electricity it produces off their bill. Once the home is fully completed and up and running, they will be living a life of no hydro bill, no fuel bill. All they'll have to worry about is the phone bill. For Go Winnipeg, I'm Blair Malstravich.